What's good, y'all? It's your world capper, Prince of Picks, at your service, here from the Pick Management Podcast Network. And I'm here to give y'all my best, best for the NBA slated games taking place on Sunday, February 11th, 2024. Uh, it's only a couple games on today. Uh, it's a light slate, so uh, Jacob's going to take the day off. I'm going to be riding solo, uh, and I'm going to give y'all my best bets, and then we're going to get you guys out of here so y'all can catch this Super Bowl going on later tonight. Uh, so without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. Uh, we're going to start off with a 2 p.m. Eastern tip-off where the Miami Heat are going to be hosting the Boston Celtics. Uh, some trends for this game, uh, both teams are currently top seven defensively. Um, offensively, Boston is currently fifth in the league. Meanwhile, Miami sitting at 27th in the league offensively. Uh, so for that reason, we like Miami here. Our, uh, team total under 111 and a half. That's at minus 140. Uh, I'm also going to be on Chris Tapps Porzingis over half a turnover. Uh, that's going to be at minus 120. Um, I think the activity of Miami defensively is going to cause Porzingis a lot of problems uh, with his ball control and ball handling. Um, and I think Bam Adebayo uh, is just a little bit too much of an athletic mismatch uh, for Porzingis to to. Uh, to be able to handle. So uh, I think he's going to cause him a lot of problems uh, with his ball security. So I'd like him to get at least one turnover in this game. I'm also going to be on Jimmy Butler, two plus steals. Uh, he has had two plus steals in each of his last three games in a row. Um, and, you know, with, uh, I think they're going to rely on him to uh, be a major defensive presence here against either Jalen Brown or Jason Tatum. Uh, so based on his defensive usage, um, I like him to get two plus steals here. Um, uh, as far as taking a side here, Miami, they're just three and six ATS with a rest advantage. Um, so, uh, you know, I know they've had four days off, but I'm staying away from a side here to cover um, just because the trends don't really suggest um, that that really makes much of a difference when they have a rest advantage. So uh, I won't be taking a side here, but otherwise, again, Miami team total under 111 and a half. Porzingo, Porzingis over half a turnover, and Jimmy Butler two plus steals. Um, and then finally, we're going to go to a 3 p.m. Eastern tip off where the Oklahoma City Thunder will be hosting the Sacramento Kings. Uh, some trends for this one. The Thunder, uh, they've lost two games in a row, uh, coming off of a 146 to 111 blowout loss at Dallas on Saturday night. Uh, meanwhile, the Sacramento Kings, they have lost two of their last three games, uh, but they did have a convincing win uh, against the Denver Nuggets at home, 135 to 106. Um, Kings, uh, they're currently 11 and 4 ATS with a rest advantage. Uh, meanwhile, Oklahoma City, they're just 5 and 3 ATS on a back to back. Uh, so for that reason, I like the Kings here, uh, plus three and a half at minus 120. I think they, I think they keep it a game here. I think they're a live dog, um, you know, with, with the Thunder uh, playing an up-tempo style of play. Same with the Kings here. Um, you know, sometimes it's hard on a back-to-back. Uh, you know, you could get winded. Your legs could could go out from you um, towards the end of the game here. So um, I like Sacramento here to keep it close, plus three and a half. Uh, then I'm also going to be taking the game total over 240. That's at minus 110. Uh, for the last five Kings games, I uh, have seen the total go over 240. Um, and also each of the last three Thunder games has also seen the total go over 240. Um, and their previous matchup went to 251 uh, for the game total. So um, I like the trends here to suggest that this should be a high scoring game. So I will be taking the game total over 240. Uh, that's going to do it for me. Uh, you guys can make sure to follow us on YouTube here at Pick Management Podcast Network. Uh, as always, you guys can follow me on X and TikTok at Prince of Picks 10. Make sure to follow my buddy Jacob here at Pick Management. You can also follow other members of the Pick Management Podcast Network. Uh, Ashley, you can follow her at Soccer Q Ash VIP. And you can follow our newest member, NHL Mark, uh, at Better Days Ahead. That's B E T T O R D A Y S Ahead. Uh, that's going to do it for me. And until next time, we will see you soon.